Oh, the side flip right strat doesn't work. Oh my god, okay. So yeah, everything is unlocking now. That's that's great. Here, you want to just jump onto the slope on the left. Just get the boulders. Don't turn too far right in the in the air. Sort of like sort of graze like the wall, and should be fine. You won't trigger them. side here. Uh, we're gonna skip the two birds so just uh, jump through it. Uh, 45 degree angle. Have a like uh, like this spot like a foot maybe a little bit over the edge or it you know inside of it is fine. I should do the trick. Uh, this jump so we're gonna do this. Uh, what I use as a visual is uh, when Lara passes like the uh, you know that the peak of this uh, cavern when Lars head passes that, um, grab. So it needs to be like a late grab, so I'll tell you when. Now... Uh, we're gonna skip the skidoo, just, uh, you know, to make sure that we get the Tibet on foot achievement. But if you're doing piss alone, you just get on that skidoo and uh, just go, go, go. I think, wait, it, will it work? Or maybe you should play it safe like I'm doing. I don't know. You, you. I'm not sure. I don't. I really don't know. No idea. Such a cozy stream. <laughs> You're playing with the controller, but trying to hit the space bar to throw the flare, which takes. What do you use for the the flare? What's your binding? What's your button for that? <laughs> That's gonna be two leopards here. Are oh, you using keyboard for that? I have mine bound to the uh, the right analog stick. You push it in. Spacebar. You're using controller. Yeah, bind it to the right uh, analog stick, pressing it in. That's what I do. Okay, here. This jump can be quite, like, uh, precise, so just roll off the edge. And then roll and do a running jump and grab. And you'll get it every time. Do, 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 do. By the way, should I go for the... Uh, should I raise the drawbridge or not? Did, has anyone got this achievement by not raising the drawbridge? The Tibet on foot. Yeah, you can map that with uh, wh whatever control you're using, whether it's DS4 Windows or you, you can use Anti Micro or Joy to Key. That works. I think you can also use Steam too, right? If you just add it as a non Steam game. Anti Micro X, yeah. Oh, I didn't know where. So you play with uh, Controller 2, where, Stella? Are you in the, the controller club? Oh, yeah. oh hey Matt! How you doing? <laughs> it's a fuck. I have a, such a hard time reading chat and just talking. I'm really bad at it. Use controller. I know you do, because uh, you used to have the uh, uh, the Logitech uh, gamepad display. Uh -huh. I remember. Unless you were trying to fool us the entire time. You were actually playing with a keyboard. <laughs> like me think, it's like me drinking tea, you just, know, you just don't know. You're, all you see is the mug. The keyboard corner. The thing is, I grew up with these games on the PlayStation, so that's why I prefer a controller. I do think keyboard is better, though. 
You have a slight advantage with it. You group on PC. See, you know what's wild with me? I thought like the PlayStation version was the most popular version, but apparently um, PC, the PC version of these games sold half the copies of the PlayStation. I think. But yeah, that blew my mind. I thought PlayStation would be like way more, like 80% or something. Yeah, it's because of the hotkeys and, uh, well, most of the speedrunners, the top speedrunners, they, you know, they use keyboard. It's just much more precise with, like, what well, you think about it, using D-pad for the, uh, using your thumb for the D-pad. Whereas, uh, keyboard players, they're using, like, three fingers from the movement. Oh, that's much damage there. Yeah. But it, I think it's like, it's it's slight. It's not like a big deal, really. It's funny, because it's the same thing in like, they have this thing in like Trackmania as well, for anyone that plays Trackmania. But like, uh, controller is better in some parts than keyboard, and keyboard is like better with ice. So. Nah, it doesn't really matter. It doesn't matter for me. It's not like I'm going to go and get like world records and stuff. Unless you do it for fun. Um, shall we do the... Oh, I'm going to do the drawbridge, I think. Just for peace of mind. Why am I not using it? Uh, to get the achievement. Yeah, I better play it safe. So I don't know if um, just killing, running people over with a skidoo breaks the achievement or not. So I'm just going to play it super safe. Actually, why don't we just... Uh... We're going to be real sneaky here. I think it's this corner, right? Is this the corner of dreams? Yeah, and it's one. It's one jump as well. Yeah, just do that. All right, we got... <laughs> what is this? <laughs> so, we we grab the key because we want to do it legit, and then we, co we we use a glitch to get out. Makes sense. Don't worry, guys. We're raising the drawbridge. It's... it's, it's don't, don't hate me, core design. It's, st it's still Devin, I think. Right, guys? Oh, there's an achievement for the... Oh my god, okay. That would have killed me. Yeah, watch out for that. They're still top runners to use use controller, but like the top like top runners um, are all keyboard players. Oh my god, this is gonna be uh, we fun. We have to kill this guy, or should we try and get past him? Uh -huh. Fuck me. Don't worry, I'm confusing him. Oh, what a bastard. We have to kill him. Uh -huh.
Oh my god, this is... Let's try running, I think. Uh -huh. That might work. Just have a good line. I'm gonna save. I don't want to kill this guy. Uh, no! Oh, that was... <laughs> Oof. I think we made it. There we go. Yeah, he's... Especially with, like, the pistols. I just... It's gonna take too long to kill, I think. Yeah, he's really annoying. I just prefer running. Yep. This does, uh, it just takes ages to kill, doesn't it? And then you have to, like, dodge him and, like, you know... It's much easier to run, like it's pacifist. I think. Well, I'm doing most of the skips now, just to... Well, most of, like, the faster skips, so that I'm not standing there, you know, taking two years to kill someone. Thank you, Lucky, for the follow. Thank you so much. Make sure not to stand on that secret tile or you trigger uh, two leopards. Oh, I, I hope it unlocks. Hope it unlocks. Hey, Lucky Dave, how you doing? Ooh, I can get a drink. Too many secrets here. He'll be furious that I missed a secret. Don't tell him. There was no secret, guys. We could try to do the Barking Monastery achievement with the glitch, just to uh, see if it works. And then if it does, then you know, anyone else who wants to do that achievement can just easily do it. You gave up a long time. No, don't say that. I can't. <laughs> Have you given up on me? Given up on me. Yeah, the monk achievement where you, you can't... Don't let any of the monks die. I'm going to try and do that with the... Uh, uh, the item dupe. But... The thing is, if I do the swan dive glitch, I don't know if they're going to die to the enemy so I might need to go back down normally and then use the main hall key and just try kill the enemies Let's see if it works that way Last time you played it was the PS1 era. Oh, you should um, play through these games again. I just really like the remasters. Uh, the remasters are brilliant. They've really captured the original games very well. I mean, it's like practically the same games, but just with enhanced graphics and uh, uh, quality of life features. I think we can all say that they've done a fantastic job, like... You know, because you never know with remasters sometimes if it's, if they're going to botch it, you know, like the GTA uh, definitive. So we're going to go around here. We're not going to kill these guys. Fuck that. 
So we're going to wait here, have a flare out, wait for them to come by, and then it's going to jump over here, flare cancel it. Oh, this part's going to be very tricky. I don't know if we can... Actually, we can skip this guy. I think we can skip this guy. I have to be fast, though. So jump this way. And stick on the right side. I think that skips the skidoo. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So you just do that. Uh... The PS1 Mini? Is that... Does that come with, like, a bunch of, uh, PS1 games? Isn't that the one with, like, that comes with, like, 50? Uh, doing a really good job, but you can tell there's been a key... Oh, yeah, it surprised me, because I didn't know this. That, uh, there are people that have worked on this game that have been in the community, like, Troy, Arson, uh, x -Proger, who did the Open Lara. Um, Delka, Tiroli, uh, made some fantastic Tiroli's, probably others that I've not mentioned, but I, yeah. It's why it's been quite faithful. And this game also has first person. Oh, Lara, why did you have to do that? Edge. I'll just heal. Run enders. Yeah, Matt, can you imagine doing this uh, pistol only with no meds? God, that would suck big time. No. Uh, 30 games. Okay. Uh, actually, the game sign of the remasters. Ah, oh, that's cool. So here, um, side flip left. So you avoid the trigger. Um, we're gonna go. I guess we'll go up here and do the swan dive down. That should be good. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, you, you you're always gonna get negative uh, negativity with whatever is released or e just anything in life. Um, yes, we got it. Okay, cool.